welterweight fight. So these fighters relatively close in age, just a year apart. Some differences in height and reach. Let's get it started. Here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC welterweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. A mixed martial artist holding a professional record of 31 wins, 15 losses. He stands 5 feet 9 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting at Lake Forest, California, USA, Jake the Juggernaut Ellen Burger. And now we're going to see his opponent fighting out of the right corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 13 wins, 7 losses, and 1 draw. He stands 6 feet 3 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of Seoul, South Korea, he young the ace, Lear! And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Levine. The veteran Eve Levine draws the assignment here. And we are underway. Ah, missed on that one, Joe. Ellen Berger gets crushed with that hook. Nice punch by Lynn. Oh, he landed a good series of punches there. Lynn gets tattooed by that straight punch. Kulem is in some trouble. Back to the feet. Oh, very nice. He's fainting with the punch. Finds a home for that left hook. Hard overhand punch. We got a fight, folks. Just missed with a huge kick. Oh! So more output, at least in the early going. Ellen Berger gets caught with that punch. Everything Lim throws with fight. Oh, the huge right hand. hand! Oh, that one hurt him. Oh, head kick! Oh, big left hook over the top. Big she body shot. Well, he established the jab early and going right back to the well here. Missed that shot. And there's a nice left hook to the body. Lim gets hit by that leg kick. Trying to establish that jab once again. Oh, a good lead right by Lim. Misses with that punch. Clean punch. Under three minutes remain in round one. Oh, beautiful kick to the body there, and he just left himself wide open for that strike. Very vulnerable by leaning in, keeping the guard high to allow for an opening down low. Looks oh, like it did stun him a little bit. This could be it right here. Attempts a big hook to the head, but misses. How about that shin? Continues to snap off these jabs. Good way to keep his opponent at distance. Under two minutes to go. He landed a left hand there. Oh, how about the output for this fighter here? A lot of good time shots there, and they're all landing. That one hurt. Nice shot. Tags him with the left hand. Ellen Berger gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Got to shore up the defense here, though. Nice punch there by Lynn. Oh, he blocked that offense, Joe. And he's looking for that left. <laughs> oh, 
Beautifully timed and placed kick there by Ellenberg. Big power shot there. Ellenberger's lower jaw now, Joe, starting to show some signs of swelling. Nice leg kick, very quickly done. Try to establish that jab. That's Whoa, a big uppercut he just landed. Nice leg kick. What a fight we got going on here. Ellenberger's uppercut is blocked. Looked like for a minute he had a window there and closed quickly. Good left hand. Thirty seconds to go. Left hand. Very nice. Really threw a lot of power into that uppercut, but missed. Damaging punch there. Final seconds of round one. Almost hits him with that left hook. Beautiful oh, left hand. A big left hand. <laughs> round two winding down. So he heads back to the stool after a dominant round. Great round there from Ellenberg. There was a huge moment in that round and a huge moment in this fight. Let's take another look at some of the action from that round. Here's a vicious kick that results in a knockdown. Let's take a look at it again. And let's see if we can get a better look at that from this angle. Brittany Palmer is here as well. You ready? You ready? Second round underway. Now, starting off this round, he might still be hurt. He's going to want to look to be defensive and move and avoid getting hit and try to recover. Jake Ellenberg. Oh! This could be it. Oh, very nice. Straight right hand now just misses. Oh! Lands a good combination. left hand. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Slips. No, oh, the left leg goes high. Oh, look at him snap off the jab. That's pretty to watch. Beautiful employment of the jab here. Wow! Oh, he is clearly in big, big trouble. Check on the leg kick offering there. Back to the jab now, no good. Well, he's landed some excellent shots in this fight tonight, but more often than not, it has been one and done. So the emphasis now moving forward, combinations. Throw your punches in bunches and really try to force the issue and get your opponent out of there. Nice punch by Lim. Oh, misses with the jab. How about that shin? A good right hand on the top. He's hurt. He's hurt. He's hurt. He's in big trouble. Hard left hand. Holding on to him here, not really doing too much. Perhaps just looking to recover. He's changing knees here in the clinch. Nice job staying busy here in the clinch. That knee might have landed there. And now he's got the tie clinch. He gets that double underhooks. He's got the plum here. Just reached the midpoint of the fight. Knees right here. He's got to get those knees to the body. He lands one. And from here, transitions to the Muay Thai clinch. 
And there comes the separation now. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the middle. That one appeared to stun him. Oh! 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 He tagged him again. Back up. Leg kick now. He's down! Joey missed with that straight right attempt. Nice. Under a minute. And now to go in round two. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. Nice punch by Lynn. Oh! oh! Unbelievable. Total domination. And that's going to do it. Straight punch for the KO. Yeah, Joe, I'm not sure if that's the way he drew it up, but a huge result for him here tonight as he gets the win by way of knockout, and that's about as good a one-strike finish as we've seen here in the UFC in recent memory. I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, so a big, big win for him here tonight.